your hands like this. down with no pads, but I'm so comfortable with you guys today. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. The thing is, is, you know, I was on the European cruise for, um, drag, for the drag stars at sea. Oh, <laughs> were you there? Were you there? Well, let me tell you a story. I went to one of the, one of the um, parties there, and you're supposed to dress up, right? You're supposed to be like drag queens or whatever. And I, I went there, because I'm a drag queen, whether Raven and Delta like it or not. <laughs> show and the, one of the fans came up to me and she said you're so pretty and I love you so much even though you're not a real girl and I said, excuse me ma'am what is real girl what does that mean and she said well you know like a cinch twist or whatever and I said ma'am you're more boxy than I am I want to know when human beings forgot the memo that women come in all shapes and fucking sizes. Yeah! Do you not realize that? It's, you know, I want to just say something though, because a lot of queens call me lazy. It's not called lazy, it's called being fucking realistic sometimes. Yeah! I mean, the thing is, if I was a teenage girl, my body would look like this, okay? I like, I like pizza, I like grilled cheese, I like Taco Bell, I give no fuck. So, the thing is, this shit got to stop though. If you're a woman, just know there's no such thing as real girl. There's such thing as real fucking girl, okay? You're a girl! Deal with that! But I just thought I would have to get that out of the way. And I'm really glad that I wrote that song before, you know, whatever, all that bullshit happened. But um, I love you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah, um, yeah this next song. <laughs> I wrote this song about a boy in high school. <laughs> I, was, I was really, really infatuated with him, even though he had a girlfriend. I, I, I hoped his girlfriend died every single day that I woke up so school. <laughs> because he was gorgeous. Um, no, but his name was Greg Ahern and he went to Azusa High School. <laughs> hey, you know what's fucked up? These girls were like sending me his page and like, I found him for you! And I'm like, no, don't do that. <laughs> he still lives by me, girl, he gonna get me job. Like, no. But um, yeah, I promise to never say his name again, Greg Ahern. Um, yeah, but uh, he was awesome. He was so hot, he came up to me because my friend and I used to stalk him during summer school. <laughs> We were working out on the track, but he wasn't wrestling. I had to get my fitness on. Uh, yeah, and right after we go buy fucking jelly donuts. No, but we're, we're like there jogging because he would take his shirt off and his, his, his um, pants, he would just jog in his boxers. And we're like, oh, he doesn't have shrinkage, he's a keeper. So, yeah, yeah, that was my man. And um, I didn't care who told me what, but he came out to me and gave me his number, but he thought I was a real girl because back then I was a little Woo! transy, you know? I was very trans, I was a trans. I'm not gonna say that girl, yeah. I almost got my penis chopped off in boots. It's all good. It's good. It's good. I don't judge, girl. It's all good. I was a pretty bitch. Okay. Yeah. No, but hey, he came up to me. He came up to me and he gave me his number and I was like, well, I'm a guy. And he's like, oh, dude, I'm sorry. And I was like, oh, oh my God. I wish death upon your girlfriend. So I wrote this song. This is Hello, I Love You to Greg A. Hammer. 